Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Friday, August 9th, 2019. Free pick coming up in just a moment. Off to a winning start in preseason football. We cashed last night. We got one more play in NFL preseason for this week, for week one, and it goes on Friday. And you can still take advantage of the 35% off offer over at DocSports.com for week one of NFL preseason. Use the code PRE35NFL. That's PRE35NFL. Get 35% off, and that offer is good right up until 10 p.m. Eastern time, Saturday night. That's when it goes back to the regular price. But you can buy my play on Friday, and you can get another handicapper of your choice, preseason week one football, week one only, two cappers. And again, you'll get it for 35% off opening week in preseason football this week. And again, that code word to use, pre-35 NFL. And again, we have the one play going uh, in Friday's NFL. That's available right now as I speak. But it's been a terrific week in all sports. In fact, since Sunday through Thursday night, we're a perfect 10 and 0, and you're up $4,800, wagering just $100 per unit since Sunday. We've just had a real nice run this week. It's been great. Baseball, 4-0. WNBA, 4-0. 1-0 in the NFL preseason. 1-0 in NASCAR, which was last Sunday. Altogether, 10-0 going into Friday's card since Sunday. I already told you about what's going on Friday's NFL preseason. We got a big NFL smash. WNBA won again last night. Six-unit winner with Los Angeles today. We've got a WNBA slam dunk. It'll be available at 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific on Friday. We'll look to extend in the WNBA run, which is now 26, 12, and 2, 68% with our last 40. We've got baseball, a six unit play. Our top play on Friday is baseball, six unit play. Uh, cashed again yesterday with the Cubbies. We're 4 0 since Sunday. Grab that six unit play in baseball at 11 30 a.m. Eastern, 8 30 a.m. Pacific. CFL, one play this week. It goes today on Friday, and uh, we're 63% this season in the CFL, 110 and 76, going back about a decade. A lot of stuff to talk about, as you just heard, on Friday, NFL preseason, WNBA, baseball, CFL. If we sweep, we'll be 14-0 since Sunday. Go check it out over at DocSports.com. Also, a real quick note before I get to the free pick. Uh, listen, if you got a, if you get a chance on Friday at 4 p.m. Eastern, 1 p.m. Pacific, I'll be in studio over at VSIN, and uh, we'll be on with Patrick Maher. I've done a lot of work with Patrick at Mad Dog Radio. I've been on his show, uh, a weekly guest for about six years, five or six years now, and uh, he's also working for VSIN now. And I'll be in studio with Patrick 4 p.m. Eastern, 1 p.m. Pacific on Friday afternoon on VSIN. So check that out if you get a chance. Sure, we'll be talking about what happened on Thursday night in preseason what it means for week two in preseason, adjusted numbers uh, throughout the day and night in baseball. Can't wait to talk about the Nats and the Mets. That series opening on Friday. I'm sure we'll cover it all. All right, let's get to the free pick for Friday's card. We're going to turn to baseball, big divisional battle, uh, the Indians at Minnesota. We've got a first five innings play here on the under between these two. The total's five and a half, juice around a dollar twenty on the under. That's the way we're going. Uh, we got a couple of pitchers here I think are going to do well for their respective teams. You've got, of course, Bieber going for the Tribe. Bieber's been incredibly stingy in this situation that he's in today throughout the course of the season. His team is on a 10-2-2 under run when he starts against teams with a winning record. As far as the Twins are concerned, you got Dave Smeltzer. Here's the thing about Smeltzer. He's had five starts this year. Four have been strong. One was rough. He, uh, that rough outing, by the way, came against these Cleveland Indians. So we might get a little chip on his shoulder in this particular start. But I think that one start in Cleveland, as opposed to Minnesota, was an anomaly. If you look at what he did, he threw six innings, six full innings, allowing three runs, and he gave up two more in the top of the seventh. So overall, six and a third gave up five innings. But he only gave up five hits. The thing is, he gave up four home runs at Cleveland. I don't see that happening by the Tribe Bats tonight. And when you look at Smeltzer, his other 21-plus innings pitched on the season, his other four starts, he's given up a grand total of one home run. We're going to play under five and a half. First five innings total, under five and a half runs. Cleveland and Minnesota, and we want Bieber and Smeltzer on the mound. So there you have it, our free pick for Friday. Again, we go into Friday 10-0 since Sunday in all sports. Go grab all four games that we have uh, wagered on for Friday's card. And uh, you can get, again, the NFL and the CFL right now as I speak. If you like these videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I'll be right back here Saturday morning, 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific. And I expect to have another college football over under wins total at that time. Let's put Friday in the win column right back here Saturday.